welcome back so the next topic in our adverb form is alternative so let's see what is alternative and how we can make use of it alternative we can use to print the condition based data this means that in any form if you want to perform some kind of validations or you want to calculate like some conditions okay and based on the conditions if you want to print data then in that case we can make use of alternative so alternative contains true and false nodes here you can see this is alternative node and inside the alternative we have one true node and we have one false node which can be decided based on the condition in alternative conditions so whenever we add this alternative node in the context here we can see one button as the alternative condition if this condition is satisfies then the true node will be get trigger else the false node will be triggered here we can add multiple operand with the in uh, with the or or an operators and based on that if the condition is satisfy then all the values inside this will get trigger and inside the node we can display either a text field graphics tables loop etc fine so this is very important point sometime like based on some condition you want to print the graphics company logo in all or you want to print different table like here the scenario which i am going to cover take example if from the interface from the input parameter i will pass whether i want to display sales order or bring document so if the sales order is x this means that condition is true system will display the sales order details if it is false then it will display the billing document details fine so let's log into our sap system and see one demo of the alternative so in sap go to transaction code sfp in the interface now i'll create one zk int 02 let's say i'll underscore alternative click on create demo on alternative and internal table we'll also learn how to display data of the internal table interface type keep the above dictionary as it is click on save local object in the importing parameter i want to fill first is ip underscore vbeln of type vbeln this is mandatory and second field i'm just taking one flag let's say ip underscore so of type flag this will decide my conditions okay now what i want to do i want to display some billing document data from vbrk table and sales order data from the vbak table this is vbrk that is billing document for the same customer i will display the sales order or billing document data for sales order we have the table vbak that is the header table and vbrk is a billing document header table okay so second point here is after adding a importing parameter i need to do some type declaration for selecting fields from sales order and the billing document okay so let me create a type declaration here begin of tp underscore so that is sales order i will select limited field vbeln of type vbak vbeln second field i want to select as the er date of type vbak er date third field i will select as aurt vbak aurt sales document type then i want amount net wr 
of type VB aka net WR and then last field that is the customer ID Kunnar type VB aka Kunnar and this will be end of TP underscore SO okay second now here I will define an internal table table type because like a smartphone in the global data here we cannot use like type is standard table of so either we have to create a SC11 table type or based on this type declaration we can define the table here table type here like type table of TP underscore SO okay now let's begin of TP underscore bill that is invoice okay end of tp underscore bill and in between i will add the field from vbrk vbln type vbrk vbln second field fk art of type vbrk fk art third field i will select fk date okay that is a billing date from vbrk fk date next field i want here net wr that is the invoice amount vbrk net wr then customer id k u n r g of type vbrk k u n r g okay so along with alternative we'll also learn how to work with internal table how to display the internal table data okay now tt underscore bill type table of tp underscore bill save check no error now go to code initialization block okay here I will take input as IP underscore VB ELN and one more importing parameter as IP underscore SO <coughs> in the output two table sorry I forgot to okay let me first add here GT underscore SO and one more I will add GT underscore bill before this we have to add we have to add those global we have to declare the global table I have not done that okay so after type declaration first come to global data click on append row gt underscore so type tt underscore so see in a smart form what we do basically in a smart form actually we can directly type here type standard table of to declare the internal table right but here we don't have that option that's why first we have to do the type table of declaration and define a table here okay similarly gt underscore bill of type tt underscore bill I will add two more variables here for heading gv underscore so of type char 50 and let's say I want to type here like sales orders okay and one more field like GV underscore bill of type care 50 let's say billing documents okay those two are variable and those two are internal table now again I will go back to code initialization first let me save now here if IP underscore VB ELN okay one more change I will I want to do here let me delete this I will not take VB ELN in the importing parameter instead of that I will take customer okay IP underscore Kunnar okay IP underscore Kunnar in the importing parameter remaining all same come to code initialization here add 
ip underscore kunnar customer id okay now i will write if ip underscore kunnar is not initial and ip underscore so is not initial okay ip underscore kunnar is not initial in the else part so what i want if customer id is there and ip so is not initial i want to select sales order data so how to write the details for that like select vbln our second field is er date third field is au art fourth field is net wr and then kunnar all this field i want to select from vbak into table into table gt underscore so where kunnar equals to ip underscore kunnar see importing parameter will get customer id and whether we want so or not so if the so flag is set then i'm selecting sales order number sales order date order type net wr and customer id from vbak into this gt underscore so table where customer id equals to this ip underscore kunnar now next if so is initial and customer id is passed to next i will select the billing data alternate okay so i will select vbln fkart then fk date then i want net wr and ku nrg from vbrk into table gt underscore bill where ku nrg equals to ip underscore kunnar see for the customer id in vbak field is kunnar in vbrk the field is ku nrg okay save check no syntax error activate so now our interface is ready okay next what we'll do we'll create the add web form by using this interface as of now what we have done importing parameter to field ip underscore kunnar ip underscore so okay this is mandatory and so is optional then in type declaration we have defined a structure for so details and billing details with table type then we done the global data declaration for internal tables and to variable i have added after that we did the code initialization okay and here we selected the data from the table okay so now our interface is ready so once the interface is ready and activated next we have to create the add web forms